Hello, I am Abraxan Evelyn, the beautiful chick. Welcome to my channel, a place where you'll find a lot of tips and tricks for food and beauty. Today on the Beauty for Chick, come along and I'll show you how to make pepper soup quick and easy with noodles. That's the recipe. Here are the ingredients. I have basil, dill. Yep, by now you know I love to use dill, pepper soup, spices, salt, oregano, garlic, peppers, bell peppers, that's tortasse, onions, Goat meat, bomo, and shaki. Those are the protein I will be using. I don't know if bomo is a protein. And Indomie noodles. You know, I'm a recipe developer, right? Let's see what I'll come up with this. Alrighty. You want to start by boiling your meat. Add all the spices. Not now. <laughs> so now what you're going to add is salt, your seasoning, your pepper and garlic. Whole. You drop all of them whole in this meat combo. Let's call it a meat combo. Meat combo. Repeat after me, guys. Meat combo. <laughs> I love to boil pepper soup meat using pressure cooker. That way it cooks very soft and nice. And then it saves you time. So while we wait, I'm going to go ahead and... Prepare my peppers and dill for blending. Now the meat is cooked. Using the pressure cooker takes about 15 to 20 minutes. If you're not using a pressure cooker, it'll take longer. So I continue to blend my pepper, garlic. You can either blend it using food processor or you pound it or you blend it but I like my peppers to be visible. So I use a food processor. And you wanna bring this into your boiling meat combo. Remember that's what we're calling that, meat combo. All right, you guys. Now you want this to boil and go into every part of the meat for let's say about 10 minutes then you taste and add seasoning not necessary if you do not want to but i just wanted to add more to that and the journey to our pepper soup is almost true thank you so much for hanging out with me thus far we end finish now I tried to use the food processor to break my Indomie noodles into pieces but the result I got wasn't favorable so I changed my mind but to this mix I brought my oregano I brought my pepper soup spices you can find pepper soup spices in the market. It's not a big deal. Then I blended this together because Indomie does not take time to cook. So it can go in the same time as your spices. Now look at how that looked. I didn't like it. So I transferred this into a dry blender that blended it exactly how I wanted it. I wanted it to be in a powder 
form just like so now how do i come up with this recipe trust me i just go in the kitchen and they just come they just come into my brain into this pepper soup that has been boiling with the pepper i bring in my indomie noodles <laughs> and allow it to boil for like a minute or two and oh my god you should be in the kitchen right now. This aroma is the bomb that come. Have you liked this video? What are you waiting for? Remember our basil? At this point, you bring in your basil, stare into this beautiful pepper soup, and your pepper soup is ready. Pepper soup is ready. This pepper soup is the yummiest pepper soup you would have ever ever tasted by the time you're done making this recipe you're gonna give me a call or you send me messages to say damn girl how did you come up with this look at how beautiful this looks oh my god imagine this in your tummy it will just be going yummy yummy in your tummy all right people i honestly honestly do not take it for granted that you keep coming back to my channel to watch every content i put out there thank you so much i appreciate you i really truly do you can eat this pepper soup by itself you do not need to eat this it's a meal by itself and uh, if you haven't subscribed you want to consider subscribing feel free to share this video leave me a comment and let me know what you think about this never seen before recipe of pepper soup with indomie noodles yes this was a really, really delicious, yummy meal. You can have this for dinner. You can have this for lunch. But it's nicer as dinner. Yes, guys. Go in your kitchen and just come up with recipes. Don't you get tired of every day cooking the same thing over and over and over? Don't you? Alrighty, people. Thank you so much, guys. My thank you does not ever finish. By now, you should know that. I truly appreciate you. You make my journey on this YouTube a very interesting one. Like I said, subscribe if you haven't and press that bell you'll be notified each time i have a video bye guys mm -hmm. ah.